welcome back to my channel today i thought i would do like a uh get ready with me because i'm having lunch with my family and we're just gonna go out to eat somewhere so i figured i'll do some really quick makeup because you know i look i look dead so the first thing that i'm gonna get is my lotion i usually um put lo this lotion on my face because um during the winter and like not just the winter, but sometimes my face just feels really, really dry, like around the T-zone. And sometimes it's really oily, but today is one of those days that it's just really dry. And I need to put something on. You guys, I'm so tired. Christopher looks like he got, he's getting sick again. And if you watch my other videos, you guys know, you guys would know that, um, he was sick with bronchiolitis, um, and then, um, he started, like, having really bad boogies in his nose again, just like before, and I'm really scared to think that he, he's getting the RSV virus again, and, I don't know, you guys, I put a lot of primer on because... My pores are huge, and I feel like this one, this primer, the um, the Master Prime from Maybelline, Maybelline really helps me with that. So I'm really tired. Mm, he was waking up every two hours at night, and I would try to like suction out the boogies from his nose, and he wouldn't let me, and then he would cry, and then. It was just a struggle, and oh, I'm just so tired. I just finished taking a shower. I uh, popped in my contacts. I use these, the Day Soft Silk contacts. I like I like these contacts. Before, when I was younger, like when I was in high school, I used to wear um color contacts. Now I'm mixing these two foundations. Um, I used to use um color contacts. And I look good with green eyes because that's the one that I used to use. But um, they like would mess up my vision even more. That's what my eye doctor said. So um, I originally was going to get um, contacts from the eye doctor. But I never got around to do that. So I just, I, would, I prefer glasses, you know. And then at contacts, I could just buy them online. So. Because my contacts, the ones that the doctor prescribed, um, like from the eye doctor place, they're like almost $300. And contacts, these contacts are $8 a box and each box has 32 pairs of contacts. So I always buy for like a couple months in advance. So that saves me money. I think the whole year, maybe I spend like 140 the whole year. And like these are um, like disposable. That's another thing that I don't like. I don't like when when like I have contacts and I can only, I only have one pair, because I know that some people prefer the ones that you um keep for like two weeks and then you throw it out or whatever. My brothers have those, but well they used to have. I think they still do, and um they like them, but I don't because um when I was wearing those um green contact lenses before I found that um they would get like blurry well I also bought them online but you know still like they would get really blurry and my eyes would just burn sometimes so I found that these disposable ones uh, work better for me because I don't like I don't like having the same contact that like I don't know I'm really picky like I can be messy with like my room and whatnot, you know. I'm not saying that I'm the cleaner, you know, because my room is a mess sometimes, and you know I don't like cleaning that much. But when it comes to like my eyes and like my my hygiene and whatnot, uh, especially with my eyes, I tend to like take care of that because I don't want, you know, I don't want anything on my eye. So. Plus, my prescription is really high. I think it's like negative 7.75. And 
you know. I don't know, you guys. I'm just rambling on and on and on. If you see me look down, it's because all my makeup is there. I'm just so tired. I had coffee already. It, it's like noon right now. And Christopher is sleeping in his swing upstairs. And my stepdad is upstairs with him, so he's not alone. But he's sleeping, so he'll be fine. Now, if he wakes up, then I have to go get him. So, But... I hope he doesn't wake up right now because I'm just tired and I want to cover my face with makeup because like you can see that I have really bad bags and I don't think I don't even think like this concealer does anything I'm so tired So, I was thinking about like ideas of what video to film next, and I saw that uh, Sarah Firestone did her um did this video where like there was like a bunch of questions. I think it's like the intimacy tag or nothing. I don't know what it's called, you guys. But the thing is that it's like a bunch of questions, and you know you gotta answer them or whatnot. So I think I'm gonna do that. It just sounds fun, I guess. Like. A lot of YouTubers are doing the um, 50 facts or something about me, but I don't even think I can come up with like 50 interesting facts. I don't know. I'm going to try. I'm going to see because I thought that would be really cool to do. Who knows? Maybe I even do one for Christopher, but like a baby edition one. I thought that was cool. I haven't seen one done yet, so I might, might do that. I'm so tired. Every time I use this foundation, I always get itchy, like right here. I don't know what it is. I was thinking about trying out the um, Born This Way. Is it like Born This Way foundation? I don't know. Something like that. But I haven't gone to the mall. I think they sell it at the mall. I'm not really sure. Either that or I'll just buy it online, but... With foundations, I kind of like them to match me with the color. You know, oh, because last time I was in the mall, that worked out so well. Last time I was in the mall, they matched me with, like, Kat Von D and um, MAC and everything. And, like, I would get it because it would look nice with the lighting in, that they have over there. But I would go home and I, it would look totally different on me. So I always, like, returned it. The only foundations that have worked for me are the drugstore ones, like um, this one, the, what is it called? The Fit Me Foundation. And that one, honestly, I just uh, color matched it myself. And, you know, it works for me. But I have to mix two colors, like I showed earlier. Like I mixed two different colors because, you know, it just depends. In the summer, I tend to go a little bit darker because I get a little bit darker. And then in the winter, I'm pale like a ghost. So, it is what it is. Uh, I'm so tired, I can't even talk to you guys. Uh, but I don't, I, I like doing like chit chat, get ready to meet. I don't know, I haven't tried a voiceover yet, but I might try that one day. Now I'm taking the e.l.f. contour and blush. Oops, I think I went over the line this time. It's fine. Oop, that was harsh. Don't worry, guys. We will blend. Blend, 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 blend. And I usually go over, like, my whole face with the... With the powder again, so... Don't worry, guys. I don't know what to do with my hair. I don't know if I should straighten it or... Because... I just, I don't know. I used to be so good at, like, okay, I'm good at doing other people's hairs, but when it comes to doing my hair, I'm not very, I don't know. I just don't like doing it. It's boring, and, but I might do something. I don't know what, but maybe. I don't know what to talk about with you guys. Um, oh, um, I was talking to my, um, my boyfriend, the 
since he's in the military, I was talking to him about, um, like, what things you can and cannot do. And, you know, there's a lot of things that you cannot do. Like, relating to, like, politics or whatnot. So, um, I don't know. Which was really interesting because some of the things that he told me that you cannot do, I didn't know that you couldn't do. I just assumed that you everybody could, you know what I mean? But it kind of makes sense of what he's talking about. So, yeah. <clears throat> I'm so tired. I think I hear him cry. No. I think I'm going crazy. Like, for new moms, do you ever, like hear or think that you hear your baby cry and then you go upstairs running and then you have my parents like your family members or something they're like what are you doing and I'm like I thought I heard the baby crying and they're like they look at you all weird and crazy and whatnot so you see how I blended that out okay that will do for the face um my face just feels so dry I'm gonna spray it with this um Herbalife Radiant thing. It just feels so dry. Like I need something. I need like moisture back into my face. Mm -hmm. You know, I still haven't found my lip balm. I still have not found it. So I've been using this. Um, It's a Revlon Color Burst balm. It has some color to it. It's like pinkish. So I've been using that. Don't worry. I usually, uh, I want to put another lipstick on top of it, so. That's just for some moisture, because like I said, my lips have been really chappy, and, you know, I've been really dry. So, I've been using that. Like, even if I don't have a foundation on or whatever, I just still put that on. Okay, now I'm going into my Anastasia palette. <sighs> Can you guys hear how tired I am? I'm just so exhausted. I'm taking the uh, sherbet color, which is like an orangey color, and I'm just applying that all over the lid, like a tra uh, translucent, translucent, trans, transition color, there you go. Mm -hmm. And this brush is from the Malika, 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 this thing. I can't talk, so I'm just gonna. Oh, I showed you guys what it is. I don't think that coffee did anything for me, you guys, honestly. You know what's funny though? Before I had Christopher, coffee would just put me to sleep, so I used to drink like a cup of coffee. Oh, that's an interesting fact. I might do that. <laughs> yeah, so it just used to put me to sleep. Like when I used to go to Starbucks. I used to get um, the Skinny Vanilla Latte, which has like two espresso shots already in it, and I used to add like two more. I know I probably look crazy with this thing on my lips, but you know what? I can't find my uh, my lip balm, so it is what it is. Now I'm going to take Hot and Cold and and just like define my crease a little bit. I might need this. I think I might need this. Hmm. I don't know what to talk to you about, guys. Who knows, maybe this will be a voiceover. But then it'll be really weird, like if I'm just moving my lips and then doing a voiceover. Okay. Pretty much for the eyes. I think I'm gonna add Super Shock Shadow by ColourPop. It looks like this. And I'm just gonna put that like all over my eyelid to give it some more color. I'm gonna take my finger because I find that these shadows work best with your finger mm. 
I did the, I did um I did a wink the other the other day. I was trying to do one and it came out nice, but then like with the baby and everything, the baby got his hands all over ah all over the eyeliner and whatnot and then I looked like a banshee. I just looked hideous. And <laughs> I called my boyfriend through FaceTime and he was like, What the heck happened to your makeup? And yeah, after that I haven't tried it. I was gonna try to do it today, but I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna do it because I think like if I'm tired and I just add like, well for me, like if I'm tired and I had like um black, what is that called? Black eyeliner on my uh, waterline. It makes me look older and it makes me look tired and I don't like to look like that so I never use it I know that some people look weird without like like if you are used to it or whatever and you don't wear it one day then you look hideous okay, I'm gonna take it out now because it really does look a little gross uh, with the foundation on I told you guys I hate putting anything on my lips Onto the foundation, but I just forgot. So, excuse me, that was a hiccup. I thought I would curl my lashes today only because when I curl them, my eyes tend to look more open. And since, you know, I'm really, really tired, I feel like they're just like down. You know what I was thinking about? I was um trying to think if I have hooded eyelids or not. I honestly don't know what hooded eyelid, like... I feel like I do have hooded eyelids, but I don't know. Because I was looking, ah, I was looking at a, a makeup tutorial, like different ways to do like a wing or whatnot for hooded eyes. And I think I do have hooded eyelids, but I never wear um, eyeliner, like a wing eyeliner anyway, so yeah but I wanted I definitely wanted to try wearing it because like sometimes if you put the eyeliner on it just completes the look you know what I'm you know what I'm saying I feel like I'm talking so low so so low but when I'm tired I don't just yell I don't yell you guys or like I don't talk very loud I just talk very quietly I still haven't bought a uh, mascara, so I'm still using this Wet n Wild one. I'm not saying it's the best, because it's probably, honestly, it's not even the best one. But, it's the only one that I have for now until I go. I was thinking about doing um a Walgreens haul, like a makeup haul, because I definitely need no makeup. And, um, I've seen that on YouTube. Oh, I got it all over my eyelid. I've seen that on YouTube. You know, they do like Walmart, Walgreens, Rite Aid hauls for makeup. So I figured, why not? You know, I like shopping for makeup, like drugstore makeup, so why not? I'm just going to put a little bit on my lower lashes. So I might do that. I messed up this eye, you guys. I got mascara on it. I don't know if it's like me or like the mascara. Or... I think it's me, you guys. I'm just gonna. I know, it's gross. But honestly, sometimes I'm just too lazy to care. I'm just gonna reapply the eyeshadow. Do, do, do. Okay, you guys, so my battery ran out of, um, my battery ran out. So I switched the batteries. Anyways, um, for lips, I'm gonna use the Master Plan and Finders Keepers on the inside. I might, I need a mirror. I need a mirror.
Is it weird that I do my that I do my makeup standing up, you guys? I think I think everybody has their own way of doing their makeup however they want to or like wherever they want to. I know that some girls do it on the floor. Mm, that's fine. I wanted to do it on the floor, but I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. I wanted to. I mean, I, I give it a try, I think, one day. Let me see. I put too much. I always have the same problem. Oh, yeah, I'm not a professional makeup person, you guys. So. That's how I just do my makeup every day. Okay, so that's it for makeup, I think. And now with the hair. Oh, my hair. My hair's a mess, you guys. It's, it's a mess. This is my natural hair. This is how it looks. So that's why I tend to curl it because it's easier for me, I guess. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Maybe, should I, should I do like a braid or something? What should I do, you guys? I always wanted to have eyes like this. Like, you know how some people have their eyes like that. I always wanted to have that. I think it's so cute. But then again, I mean, that's why you have eyeliner. I mean, you can definitely do like a wing liner. And then you're good to go. Okay, so I'm going to brush out my hair and then I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I'm back. I brushed my hair and now it's all fuzzy. Fuzzy? It's all whatever you want to Whatever it's called. So yeah, I have a lot of hair, you guys. Okay, so the first thing that I'm gonna do is dry shampoo this sucker. Cause I took a shower and I didn't wash my hair. So. And I use a Baptiste dry shampoo. The cherry, the cherry scent. And then after I'm done, um styling it well not after well if i straighten it or curl it i usually add a little bit more dry shampoo so i think i'm gonna straighten it today so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna part it off where's the clip oh here it is i use these clips i usually don't part it like this when i curl it but since i'm gonna straighten it I figured I need to. So I have my uh, flat iron, the Infinity Pro Conair by Conair, and I'm just gonna straighten it. <laughs> I'm probably just gonna fast forward this part. <laughs>
guys, so this is the final look. I just straightened my hair, and that's pretty much it. I mean, I don't really do anything that glamorous to my hair, but yeah. I normally like when it's curly, but I thought I'd do some straight hair today. Because I figured I I wear too much curly hair anyway, so this will be like something else. So I hope you guys like it. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.